and a welcome into those just joining us. We're just getting started here in the first with no score. Here comes perhaps the fastest man in baseball as Billy Hamilton strides forward to get this ball game underway. Soft liner towards short. That gets down and he's got himself a base hit. So the base hit puts the first man aboard to start the inning for the Mariners. Well, I wanted to see how he might respond to a little adversity, but I wasn't expecting Kyle it to happen after Seeger. the first guy leads off with a leadoff hit. Now he's in a stretch. Let's see if he's able to get through the rest of the inning. Maybe get a double play, a pop fly. We'll see how this unfolds. Here's the third baseman now, Kyle Seeger. The watch is fully in effect these days as he's potentially closing in on a historic triple crown. He leads all three categories. Runners off for second. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Gone into the home bullpen for a home run. A two run home run off the bat of Kyle Seeger. So he creeps ever closer to triple digits. And the Mariners move out in front two to nothing. So we'll take one more look and boy he just continues to hit the ball out of the ballpark at an alarming rate. What a year. Here's the center fielder Mike Trout. He did not play last night but clearly back in the starting nine for this one. Mike Trout. He's set. Here it comes. And a good idea to hold off on that swing. It's ball one. And Harold, these Astros entering play here tonight. Boy, the last few weeks have not been kind to them, to say the least, as they're working on trying to end a double-digit losing streak. Yeah, man. I mean, it's been real ugly watching them play recently. They just haven't played good ball, and nobody wants to watch that. Somebody's got to step up, make a big play, make a big pitch. Or Ken even the manager Ruffy making the Jr. right move. But something's got to change the, the mojo on this club to get them winning. And here's a look at the starting lineup for the visiting Seattle Mariners. Harold, what's the key to continuing the winning streak? Swung on, and this ball is absolutely crushed. Forget about it. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. Solo shot that time from Ken Griffey Jr. 45 home runs now on the campaign and the M's have taken a 3 nothing lead. Well it's very early but he's looked out of sorts from the beginning. They've already roughed him up for two homers and they're not done yet. We'll see if he can regroup or he blows up. Could go either way at this point. Striding in, Giancarlo Stanton. He enters set. play sixth in the Mike American Gilder. League in the batting race. Giancarlo Stanton. Here's the first pitch to him. Drilled on the ground to short. And a backhanded try into the hole that's short, but this gets on by. That's the seventh game he's hit in. Look that out. Exact. Seven games. That's Watch one that. week of feeling pretty Corey. good. Let's see how long he can make this last. Coming to the plate now, Corey Seager. Having a very nice year, currently second in the American League in batting average entering play. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Sung is there. Two gone. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. Now in the box, Mike Zanino. And as you take a look at the splits here, he's actually better against right-handed pitching this season. First pitch on its way. Line drive to left. And that's in there. Base hit. 
He was sitting on that fastball. You can't tell me he wasn't. First that pitch again. fastball, and he turned on First it like that. Man. Nice job. Joel Cruz. Now to the plate, Joel Koo, and there's a look at his home and road splits so far this year. Getting a few steps off the second there, now the pitch. Oh, what a pitch to start the at bat there. It's nothing in one. Wow, that, that's a little bit of a surprise. You don't see too many ugly swings from him. He's having such a great year. You think he's on most things all the time. A decent lead at second. Here's the pitch. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Sung is under it, and he makes the catch for out number three. So two home runs in the inning lead to three runs on the scoreboard. On now to the bottom of inning number one. The Mariners are on top, three to nothing. 